you beauties welcome back to my channel so today I'm doing something a little bit different I am not doing makeup or any challenge I'm actually going to be making hand sanitizer for y'all so keep in mind guys I am not a doctor and I don't like y'all are doing this at y'all's own risk if y'all like you know try to do this at home this is just like a home remedy if y'all want to try it or not um, this is y'all are basically making this at y'all's own risk so um, just keep in mind I'm not a doctor guys this would kind of help y'all you know if you're out of hand sanitizer and you need something to disinfect and stuff like that so um, I'm gonna help y'all with that I'm just you know trying to make the world a better place no I'm kidding but yeah no I'm just trying to help y'all out I looked this this recipe up on I don't know if you ever heard of it but it's called a wiki how um, I, I use it a lot to look up a lot of things on how to do things. To make hand sanitizer, you need alcohol and olive oil. You don't really need the tea tree oil, but that's just kind of like an essential oil and it also helps kill certain bacteria as well, so that's why I kind of wanted to do the tea tree oil. Um, the hand sanitizer, so the reason I have two is because the, the 50 one, the 50%, I actually got it at Dollar Tree. But the thing is, is that you need 60 or more in order to kill bacteria. So I just wanted to show y'all. I just went ahead and got it. But this one that I have here is a 70%. So this is a kind of the, this is kind of the alcohol you would want to get in order to make this hand sanitizer. Um, obviously it's sold at HEB, but I'm pretty sure HEB is like out of it. So I don't know, just try, maybe you might have some at home or anything like that. These, I got actually got these at Dollar Tree. There's a spray and then there's a regular bottle here. And then if you have olive oil gel, you can use olive oil gel. And then if you have like a plant like this, or you're actually like, you have a plant outside your house, you can use olive oil gel. But um, I just went ahead and got one of these um, because I just figured that'd be easier and it's better to get it without like any any things in it all right so I have a bow here and then I have a spoon um, so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the alcohol remember you have to get 60% or more for it to kill germs so I'm gonna go ahead and put two-thirds of alcohol in this bowl and you can just get like a measuring cup or anything that you have around the house mm. whoops one So there is two thirds of alcohol. And I'm gonna add the tea tree oil. So I got one teaspoon of tea tree oil. And this tea tree oil, I got it at Dollar Tree as well. Just gonna pour that in there. And tea tree oil is good to um, kill certain bacteria. And tea tree oil is good to um, kill certain bacteria. And I'm gonna cut the Olivera poignant. Ow! It's like I just don't understand why it's so like why it's so pointy. It's so pointy, guys. And so I'm gonna do one third of olivera gel. Oh, guys, I don't know about y'all, but olivera smells weird. It smells weird. Am I weird? Yeah, I'm weird. All right, so I'm just gonna cut it in half. I didn't even cut it right, whatever. So here's the plant, guys. You know, guys, olive oil is like really, really good for everything, everything. Like, it's good for your face, like it's good for everything. And I'm sorry, I look really, really bad, guys. It's just that I don't have any makeup on. This is gonna be like really, really sticky. It's also like a good overnight face mask, guys. It's a good overnight face mask to put on your face and sleep with, and then the next morning, your face would feel like really, really, it will feel really, really, um, what's the word? Soft. Ah, this smells like really, really bad, guys. For some reason, like I hate all there. But I know it's really, really good. So I know all this stuff is going on guys and um, we just honestly have to stick together and and brace through it and know that it's gonna be fine. 
everything will turn out just fine guys so don't panic please because when i went to heb all the toilet paper was gone like literally everything was gone guys um and i actually was out of toilet paper and then like i usually um meal plan and stuff so like i needed ground turkey and there was no ground turkey guys no ground turkey so i couldn't like i had to get regular ground beef I was like really really sad frozen vegetables frozen vegetables were all gone and i usually use frozen vegetables for my um for my meal plan as well and they were all gone canned vegetables were all gone too guys like this is just craziness guys just gotta i think what's making all the shortages is just people panicking and we just have to come together and and know that everything's gonna be okay. Don't worry, do 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 about a thing. Cause every little thing is gonna be alright. I'm literally just scraping it guys like this. Just scraping the aloe vera gel out. Um you could also blend it if you want to as well guys, but I think like this is perfectly fine. I'm sorry guys, like, I don't know, for some reason, like all of, all of it smells like armpits to me. Like, I don't know if I'm just weird, but it just smells like armpits to me. I, I don't know why, but it's good for you, right? All right, so one third of olive oil gel in here. Whoa. I did not mean for that to happen. No, look how it looks. Alright, so of course you have to stir it, guys. And you can always blend the aloe vera out. And then just stick it in here. When you just spray alcohol on your hands, like it, it, it can kind of like dry out your hands and make you bleed and make you scab. So um, I recommend that. Or maybe like put some, put some vitamin E oils in there. And you can put like some 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 other essential oils in here guys like if you have lemon if you have eucalyptus you could put it in here so you have to keep whisking it to like it's like not as jello-y i think this is good enough guys i'm gonna put it both in the spray bottle and then in a regular container as well i don't have a funnel guys so bear with me then i have like my little measuring cup i'm just gonna put it in there So let's test it out. Well, mm, it smells really, really good, guys. Like you could let, definitely smell the tea tree oil, and then it's not like it's not like too intense, like where you can smell like all the hand sanitizer. It's not like too sticky to where you can like feel the aloe vera on your on your skin it's literally like and it dried so fast guys damn actually i like how this turned out okay all right so now we're gonna try this little bottle that has the open lid this one comes out a little bit more it's not like a spray you kind of just put that on your hands wow well guys this really turned out so good i thought like i was i was like so scared i was like oh my god what am i doing you know like what am i doing and it feels like so soft because it has like the aloe vera gel which is like known to make your hands really really soft as well yeah guys so this um this home remedy of hand sanitizer didn't turn out too bad like it's actually pretty cool just in case you know you, there's like no hand sanitizer anywhere this would be a good idea to do because you know you have to Clean somehow if you're going to the store if you're going to Walmart you're going anywhere you can just take with this one on the go you know and disinfect everything you have like from the card or anything like that um, and these are like travel size so you can literally stick it in your purse this comes with like a little lid so you can stick it in your purse and then just take it on the go um, but still I recommend you know washing your hands as well I appreciate you for watching I hope y'all stay safe out there stay um, you know stay healthy just eat your green i recommend you know making some of this you know don't don't forget i'm not a doctor so if something happens 
it's not my fault no i'm kidding but um yeah I, it, it's just something to recommend you know just um when you're out on the go and and out of hand sanitizer but um yeah guys if you really like this channel or you thought this was a nice home remedy give my video a thumbs up and please subscribe for more videos and yeah guys i hope everybody stays safe stay healthy um you know that's all i can say but i really really appreciate y'all and we'll see y'all next time bye beauties